Good morning, Arthur. Hey there, Tilly. Everything okay? Oh, yes. Just doing what I can to help out around here. Yes, Miss Grimshaw. One of the girls saw that friend of yours, Mary Gillis, sniffing about. Mary? Yes. I never liked that woman, Mr. Morgan. Funny business. Hey. Hey. What's going on? I've forgotten what it was now. You're interrupting my beauty rest. Use a slug of whiskey in this. Maybe after lunch, hey? Herr Morgan! Herr Morgan! Mr. Strauss. You busy, my friend? Arthur. Tilly. Why have you got a guilty look? I don't. Okay. I know your ears are working, Arthur. You're up to something, Miss Jackson. Sure thing. Okay, then. Uh, what did you want? You loaning already? You know how it is. People is happy to borrow off someone like me, but more enthusiastic paying back to someone like you. Of course. Who are they? Hmm, let me see. A Chick Matthews works at Guthrie Farm. He's a hand, I believe. Mr. Roble, the small holder at Painted Sky, runs the operations there, badly. Miss Lily Millet is a ranch maid up at Emerald Ranch. And here was me believing Dutch's bluster about us helping folk. It's legal work, Mr. Morgan. Debtors belong in prison. We are doing them a favor. Ah, I'll make sure they see it in them terms. Put the debts in the deed box and try not to kill them. It's very bad for business. I just miss him so much. Of course you do. I'll try and see about the debts. Very good. Okay. You're gonna suffer. <laughs> and life's gonna go on. That's the truth of it. I won't lie to you. Oh, Miss Roberts. I know. We're, we're... Go. Stay here with us. Oh, they ain't so bad. It's nasty out there on your own. I know. Good morning, Arthur. Here we How are, are you, Jack? Here you was sick? A little bit, here. but Uncle Hosea gave me some medicine. Okay, good. At least for now. Until you're back on your feet properly. Found some cash in that O'Driscoll cabin, but not much else. A shotgun. And no coal? Not for now, no. You okay? Why don't you sit, Arthur? Don't you ever get fed up with all this? Sometimes, I suppose. Well, know you're appreciated around here. Sure, Arthur. Okay, I'll catch you later, then. Okay.
Wild Girls has betrayed us. They've done it happily. Is raiding betrayal in your world, Miss Grimshaw? No. There, girl. I don't miss. I don't miss his betrayal because it means I work. So you don't have to. Ugh. partner come take a look at this look at this my friend tobacco nature's gift to us all hmm. focuses the mind like nothing else whatever you say well I say why buy it off the shelves when you can make your own well plenty left here if you're interested I'd best keep moving. There you go. Let's go, girl.
Knock, knock, Mr. Robo. No, przepraszam, co pan robi w moim domu? God damn it. English? Uh, you speak English? Me? Uh, um, Silesia. Yeah, uh, good I'll for you. Silesia. I'm here for money. Do you borrow from a German man? Aha, uh, German. Uh, um, uh, mein Herr, uh, uh, sprechen das, uh, this, uh, uh, the Kaiserreich. I don't yeah? speak German neither. I'm here for money. Money. That you borrowed from Leopold Strauss. Uh -huh. Uh, uh, Leopold Strauss. Uh huh. Yeah. So it's time to pay. Where is it? Oh, well, no, I have nothing. It's very bad winter. We've all had a bad winter, pal. <laughs> Where is it? Oh, oh no. No, nie, nie. Now, you remember where you're keeping that silver? Potrzebuję trochę czasu. Znajdę ci pieniądze. No, still don't understand you. Where is the money? Gold, dollars. Nie rób tego. I have nothing. Yes. I have your things. Okay. I have anything in here or out there. Yes. The longer I look, the madder I get. What you got behind there? So, sorry, I Move aside. Rusakom, nie można ufać. My kind of też. What do we have here? Moja obrączka, nie. Just keep quiet. Don't even speak English. Something somewhere. No, 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 no. Yes, 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 yes. You must have come here with something. I need, I must eat, Prosho. Okay, that should about cover things. Mm-hmm. 
Come on, girl. You're all right, girl. Mr. Arthur, I told Dutch, I feel I should tell you. I saw some of Combs boys riding around. Down here? What they want? I have no idea. They see you? I don't think so. Okay. Well, thanks for letting me know, Karen. Mm-hmm. All right, well, I should be getting on. Right, good talking to you. Susan! Good day, Mr. Morgan. Williamson? Good morning, Arthur. How did you get on, Herr Morgan? Called in on the small holder, Robo. Didn't even speak English. <laughs> good, very good. My pleasure. Uh, well, if it's pleasure you're after, there is one other. This farmer preacher fellow I met in Valentine, Mr. Downs. The opinionated little do-gooder? Yeah, I know the one. I certainly know the type. Thank you, Herr Morgan. There's no need to thank me. Like you said, it's 
pleasure I'm after. He's more slippery than he seems. I've tried being polite. Don't take any nonsense. Nonsense? Me? If he doesn't have the money, beat him. Well, I usually do. I know. I know. City for her street and all, while all my world traveling and roaming around. I spied a fair maiden so lovely. <laughs> Gently on her I did say, she pulled up her garment, so scared it would soil. I out with old Phoenix went boring for oil. I hadn't been boring. <laughs> What you reading? Oh, some silly book. I swear I could be better. Smile, said bear down on your auger, or I know you struck all. Things went on and on for a week or ten days. My auger machinery got to fire in some way. I disagree. I ain't gonna die poor. I know that. Good luck to you, Nancy. The world is changing for women. No, it ain't. The world a place for yeah. men to do what they want with us, and we try to survive. Only if you let it, you let them. I ran away from them boys and joined these Hurry five up, women. So Pearson, I'm solving. And we're going to be okay. If you'd only see that. Dear Arthur, I've written this letter a hundred times or more, and I cannot get it right. It's me. You know it's me from the bad handwriting. I know I said when we last spoke, and I was going off to get married, that we would not speak again. I know I said a lot of things, and I meant them, I suppose, at the time. But I'm not so proud as to not speak to people who care for me, or cared for me. I've been in Valentine for a couple of months. I had some bad luck, and, well, it's a long story and not an interesting one. But I am here for now. I saw a couple of the girls, or whatever the polite term is for them, that ran with you and your associates in town, and I heard tell of a man who sounded like you. I would love to see you again. If you could spare me a little bit of your time. I'm renting a room at Chadwick Farm, just north of Valentine. Yours, Mary Linton. Hi, Mary Beth.
Karen. John? Hey, John. What do you want? Is that how you speak to me? I guess it is. You miserable scotch sack of shit. Ugh. Ugh. Nice tongue you got there, lady.